Shalom. First and foremost, I'm going to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, with Yahweh Kakwadash, which Yahweh's Heavenly Father's true name. Yahweh Shai is from the world, ignorantly calls Jesus Christ, that's his true name. And Rakakwadash is the Holy Spirit. I'm also going to give double honors to the apostles and the elders at Great Millstone who rule and teach well in the scriptures. And salutations to all you Akim out there who are pushing this word in all truth and all sincerity. And uh, it's going to be another uh, GMS scripture today. And we're going to read 2 Maccabees 6 and 12. And it reads, Now I beseech those that read this book that they be not discouraged for these calamities, but that they judge those punishments not to be for destruction, but for a chastening of our nation. And when you read the scriptures, you constantly see the Israelites going through constant hell and punishments, okay? And like how it says there, it, this stuff is not for our destruction. You know, the things that we've gone through in the past and the things that we're going through currently, it's not to destroy uh, our nation. It's it's for chastening, okay? Because the Lord, um, it tells us in the scriptures that he chastened whom he loves, all right? And... The Lord uh, loves the nation of Israel. It tells us that in the, uh, uh, the book of Malachi, the uh, first chapter, talks about how um, Jacob have I loved. And it says that Esau have I hated. So the Lord doesn't hate us. He doesn't want to destroy us. He just wants us to get in order. And this is ultimately making us a uh, better nation because we know um, both sides of everything now. All right, We know good and evil. And we're becoming a uh, perfect judge. Alright. And th th this is all for the, the embedment of us. Okay. You know these things. Had to come to pass because. We uh. We disobeyed the heavenly father. Okay we didn't follow the law statutes and commandments. And this was a part of the co contract. Okay. When you read Deuteronomy the 28th chapter. The first part talks about, from uh, verse 1 to 15, it talks about how uh, if we follow the law, statutes, and commandments and praise the Heavenly Father, uh, the, the, uh, these particular blessings will come to us. But from the uh, 15th verse to the 68th verse, the Lord said, If you break my laws and don't follow uh, my ways, these curses shall fall upon thee. And that's what happened. Those curses and then some fell upon us, man. All right. Like I said, that was a part of the contract. The Lord said this was going to happen if we didn't do uh, uh, what was commanded of us. You no. Know? 